Hi. Hi, guys. Hi, Nelson. Hi. How are Hi. you? Hi, teacher. Hi. Hi. Good. I'm okay. I'm okay. Very good. Hi, Tania. Hi, Miguel. Hi, Osvaldo. Hi, teacher. Very good. And you? Hi, Excellent. teacher. Excellent. I'm okay. I'm okay. Very nice. All right, guys. So yesterday we were talking a little bit about school supplies. All right, like pen, pencil, and everything. Okay. And we did a list. We made a list. Let me just get this. All right. So let's see. Um, Tanya, what's this? Uh oh. <laughs> what uh -oh. is it? Scissors, no. Scissors, very good. No, 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 verdad? No, no. <laughs> All right, very good. All right, let's see. Uh, my friend Miguel, what's this? Market. Marker. 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 Very good. Marker. Marker. Yes, very nice. All right. Then I have. Oh, Osvaldo, what's this? Osvaldo. Osvaldo. Osvaldo, no? All right. Nelson, what's this? Eraser. Eraser, very nice. It's an eraser. All right. Tanya, again, this one. What's this, Tanya? Chocolate. Mm. <laughs> it's a coca. It's a coca. Forget this name. You forgot it? That's okay. Miguel, what is it? Do you remember? Sharp, char, sharpener. Yes, it's a sharpener. You can say pencil sharpener or a sharpener. Very good. So what's this? Nelson, do you remember oh, what that is? Hole, hole pusher. No, this is not the hole puncher. This is the hole puncher, Nelson. Uh, oh, all right. This is the hole puncher. What's this? Anybody? Uh, Miguel or Tanya, what's this? Do you remember? No, my question. A stapler. A stapler. A stapler. And then we have, whoops, we have um, these ones. What are they? It's the, it's the it's they staples. It's staples. Very good. Staples. staples. So these are staples. And this is the stapler, right? Very stapler. good. Stapler. Okay. El famoso, okay. el famoso, hi Osvaldo, ¿logró entrar otra vez? Yes, I have a problem with uh, internet connection. Yeah, imagine. All right, guys, give me one quick moment. I need to stand up for a second. Just give me a Okay. All right, thing. Okay. All right, very good. So, what's this, guys? Do you remember what this, what this is? Pencil case. Pencil bar. Excellent. Pencil. It's a pencil case. It's a pencil, pencil case. case. Very good. All right. A ver, Miguel, what's this? Mm, uh -oh. Corrector, co corrector pen. Correction white pen out. or white, white out. out. White. Very good. White. Correction pen or white out. Excellent. All right. Nelson, do you remember what this is? Hi. Uh -huh. Hi highlighter. Excellent. Yes, it's a highlighter. Very good. Highlighter. highlighter. All right. Let's see. Osvaldo, what are these? Keys. Keys. All right, these are keys, keys, keys and one is key, right? Only one and these are keys. Very good, guys. Nice. Ya vi que se acuerdan, all right? Tanya, this one? Pencil. Pencil. And this one, guys, what is this? Pen. 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 All right, okay. So yesterday, guys, we were looking at school supplies, all these things, and we were also talking about demonstrative pronouns. We were talking about this. 
and we were talking about these, right? A ver, eh, Miguel, which one is for singular? This or these, Miguel? These. This, very good. And Tania, for plural, what is it? These. These, all right, very good. Now, Nelson, when I use this is, do I have to use a or no a? For example, I can say, this is a pencil, or I say, this is pencil. How do I say it? Is a pencil. Yes, this is a pencil. Very good. Now, Osvaldo, if I have... Le saqué todos los útiles a mis hijos. All right, Osvaldo, if I say this, what I say, these are a uh, scissors, or I say these are scissors? Hmm. These are scissors. Okay, remember that A is only for one. For example, I can say, de hecho las tijeras nunca van a ser A. Porque en inglés se toman como dos, dos, porque tienen dos como cuchillas. Entonces no puede decir, this is a scissor. I mean, these are scissors. All the time are scissors, porque son como dos blades, all right? Scissors, all right? Okay, so that's what we studied yesterday. Do you have any questions about yesterday's? Oops. Do you, sorry, do you have any questions about yesterday's class? De todos los objetos, or oh, we're okay? We're okay, no problem? Okay, no. okay, what's this, guys? Notebook. A notebook, right? Very good, it's a notebook, all right? Obviamente vimos muchos más, pero no los puedo tener aquí, la compu y todo eso, all right? But we saw those yesterday. Okay, so today, no sé, do you have questions before I move on? Or no, no questions. No questions. No questions, all right? We just need to study and we need to memorize, ¿verdad? Hacer ahí como el dibujito y tal cual para que we remember everything, okay? Very good. So today, guys, we're going to go to, um, we're, we will continue with section two, all right? And again, eh, we're going to talk about yeah, uh, the, to, the verb be, the to be verb. But today we're talking about yes, no questions, okay? So for example, I say, uh, Tanya, are you, are you married, Tanya? No, I am not married. Excellent, all right? No, I am not, or no, I am not married. Um, Nelson, are you angry? Mm, are you angry? Uh, no. Okay, no. <laughs> No, I am no. not. All right, very good. No, Let's see. Um, Miguel, are you an English student? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. All right, very good, guys. Okay, and Osvaldo, um, are you 20 years old? Uh, no, I am 30 years old. Okay, very good. So, excellent. So, that is yes, no questions. In English, we have two types of questions. Yes, no questions and WH questions. Okay? <coughs> the yes, no questions se llaman así porque la respuesta es yes or the answer is no and that's it. Okay? So, here, I just want you to listen to this. All right? And then we're gonna, I'm going to show you something else. Okay, so let's let's pay attention here. Hi everyone. In this class you'll learn how to form yes, no, and where questions would be. We'll start by listening to a quick audio program which illustrates how this topic is used. Oh no. Where are my car keys? Relax, Kate. Are they in your purse? No, they're not. They're gone. I bet they're on the table in the restaurant. Excuse me, are these your keys? Yes, they are. Thank you. See, no problem. And is this your wallet? Hmm, no, it's not. Where is your wallet, Joe? In my pocket. Wait a minute. That is my wallet. Let's try to make sense of the chart that you see on the screen. In order to form yes or no questions, we're going to follow the next formula. Verb to be 
plus this or in this case could be these plus some kind of complement. So verb to be plus subject plus complement. In this case we want to say that the subject is uh, this or these. So let's try to make some examples. As you can see on the screen the example is this your wallet. We have the verb to be in this case happens to be is and then we're going to use this the complement in this case is your wallet and then of course we put a question mark there um, the other example that you see on the screen are these your keys uh, we have a verb to be these your keys and of course we put a question mark at the end let me all right so here guys what we're asking is questions if when we want to know if this is yours for example i can say tanya is this your pencil case no uh-huh it is not my pencil case. Yes, very good. No, it is not my pencil case. All right. So in English, guys, sabe que voy a dejar compartir este aquí. Voy a empezar a compartir esta niña, sí, niña. All right. We're going to use this one. Oops, no. That's not the one. Okay. I have this one here. So in English, when we have yes, no questions, okay? So yes, no questions here, we use the verb be. For example, I say, in a sentence, we say he is from England. Abajo está, he is from England. The question is, is he from England? All right? That is the question. Le doy vuelta. Igual que ahorita yo le digo, this is a pencil case. Pero si no sé de quién es, le digo, Tanya, is this your pencil case? All right, is this your pencil case? All right, so we have answers and you can say, yes, it is, or no, it isn't. Y hasta ahí llega, all right, that's short answer. Or you can say, yes, it is my pencil case, or no, it is not my pencil case, okay? So we can answer yes, no questions in short, and we can answer yes, no questions in long form, yeah? So if I say, Tanya, is this your pencil case? Tanya can say, yes, it is. Yes, it is my pencil case. No, it isn't. No, it isn't my pencil case, okay? So you have four choices. You understand that? Yeah? All right, let's see. Uh, Nelson, is this your cell phone? Is this your cell phone, Nelson? Yes, it is. All right, very good. Or a negative, Nelson? No, it is. No, it isn't. All right, no, it isn't. No, it isn't. Or not, it's not. All right, very good. Osvaldo, are these your glasses? Osvaldo, se fue. Se salió. Ana. Osvaldo, are these your glasses? Hi, teacher. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> Osvaldo, yes. are these your glasses? Uh huh. Yes, these. Okay, uh, remember that we have two glass, I mean, we have a pair, all right? Si tenemos un par de lentes, vamos a decir, yes, they are, or no, they aren't, porque son dos, tengo dos ojitos, right? So you say they are, okay? Let's see, um, Miguel, is this your notebook? No, it's not. Okay, no, it is not, or it yes? It is not. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. All right. Just give me a second here. Uh, hold on. Just give me a second. Compartirles otra ahí. Just give me a second. Give me a second, guys, please.
Okay. So we, here we have yes, no questions with B, all right? So this is how you answer. Are you my student, for example, okay? So you can say, yes, I am, that's short answer, or yes, I am your student, that's long answer. You cannot say, yes, I'm. Tenemos que decir, yes, I am, all right? Or, yes, I'm your student. Y ahí es donde empieza, que empezamos a con, hacer las contracciones, all right? Uh, yes, you can say, are you angry? No, I'm not. No, I am not angry. No, I'm not angry. Si se fija la contracción, right? It's very, like, sometimes we use it. Ahora, cuando usted contesta en short answers in English, ya no hay más short answers. Yo le digo, are you my student? Y usted me dice, no, se oye pesado. Es como que quizás Osvaldo está molesto, ¿verdad? Así como, no, de mejor ya ni le hablo. All right, so short answers are short answers, pero no hay más corta del no, I am not, or yes, I am. So are you happy? Yes, I am. Are you happy? No, I am not. Okay, that's it. All right, so here, you, here we have, Osvaldo, léame la pregunta, y Tania, can you give me the answers, please? Okay. Uh, is this your wallet? Tania? Yes, it is. Yes, it is my wallet. No, it is not. No, it isn't not. Okay. No, it isn't. No, is isn't my wallet. No, it's not my wallet. Okay, thank you, Tania. If you notice, ponga atención ahí, ponga atención ahí, y si se fijan, hay varias formas de contestar en negativo, en positivo es más corto. O es yes it is, o yes it is my wallet, all right? Inclusive, you can say yes, vamos a agregar una, yes, it's my wallet, all right? Yes, it's my wallet, y hago la contracción ahí, yes, it's my wallet, la contracción de it. Or I say, no, it is not. Hay ninguna va con, en contractada. La otra, no, it's not. All right, el apóstrofe va entre it y el is. The other one is, no, it isn't. All right, el, el, el apóstrofe, el apóstrofe, sorry, va entre la n y la t. No, it isn't. No, it isn't my wallet. All right. On, or you can say, no, it's not my wallet. All right, usted puede jugar con cualquiera de estas. Ahora, la más rápida o la más eh, corta, digamos, es no, it's not, y hasta ahí llega. O lo hacemos como no tan, no, tan, no tan rápido, decimos no, it is not. Y hacemos todas las palabritas, las decimos todas, all right? Pero usted puede escoger en decir no, it's not, no, it isn't. No, it is in my wallet. No, it's not my wallet. Or no, it is not. Ya. Yeah? Recordar es que en inglés el primer no es no, and the second one is not. Okay, you have to remember that. All right. So let's see. Um, um, let's see. Uh, Miguel, is this your whiteout? Yes, it is. Okay, in affirmative and in negative, um, Miguel? No, it is not. Okay, or? No, it is not. Okay. Continúe ahí con todas las posibilidades. No, it isn't. Mm -hmm. No, it isn't my white out. Okay, yes, very good. No, it is not my white out. All right, very good. Yeah, okay, so you have those choices. All right, let's see. I'm going to have you here. Very good. Um, is your shoes? Acuérdense que si son shoes, estamos hablando de dos. All right, are these your shoes? Yes, they are. No, they are not. Or no, they aren't. Okay, y ahí lo vamos, la, en la última está contractada, ya, yeah? no, they aren't. Or you can say, no, they are not, okay? Do you, do you guys have questions? Preguntas hasta ahí? No ¿Cuál, era, cuál uh -huh. era el segundo, el segundo no? 
Como el no. no sí, lleva un no, como este que está aquí. Um, Nelson, ya se lo enseño. Ok, el primer no es no. Y el segundo es not. De la misma forma va aquí, Nelson. Lo que pasa es que como hago la contracción, entonces ya, ya no está la O, sino que está el apóstrofe. Pero siempre sigue siendo el, la, el not. ¿Verdad? Solo que de forma contractada. Freezing, usted no puede decir no, it is no. Eso no se oye bien. No, it is not. Or no, it's not. All right. Or no, it isn't. Todas estas aquí, esas tres, están diciendo lo mismo. Solo que una un poco más larga y las otras como más rápida, ¿verdad? Y que se usan más a la hora de hablar. All right. Yeah. Okay. Do you understand? Yes. All right. Very good. Okay. Let's see. Um, Osvaldo, is this your pencil? Yes. It, Yes, this... oh, I'm sorry, Osvaldo, I want the uh, answer in affirmative and the answer in negative. Okay. Yes, uh, this is. This... Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It is. Yes, yes, it uh, is. Mm -hmm. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. Uh -huh. No, it is no. Very good, yes. Y and not isn't not. Okay, no, it's not or no, it isn't. All right, very good. Okay, let's see. Uh, Miguel, is this your pencil case? Affirmative and negative. Both. Yes, please. Affirmative and negative. Yes. Yes, it is. Okay. No, it is not. Okay. No, it isn't. Excellent. No, it isn't my pencil case. No, it isn't my pencil case. Very good. More. Uh, no, we're complete. All right, very good. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, very good. Tanya, look at these ones. Ahora vamos con los plurales, Tanya. Estamos bien con los singulares. Oh. O oh, nos vamos a práctica ahorita de singular y luego regresamos a plural. What do you want to do? ¿Practicamos singulares? Practice. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Very good. Okay. So this is what we're going to do. Los voy a mandar igual a su, a su grupo. Van a trabajar en pareja igual que ayer porque somos un even number. Tengan a la mano cualquier objeto singular. Por ejemplo, podemos tener, no sé, el celular, un cuaderno, algo que sea uno. All right, y usted le va a preguntar, if I'm working with Osvaldo, la pregunta es, Osvaldo, is this your whiteout? Ok, como estamos practicando, eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Si gusta, I want you to take a picture of these guys. Hold on. I want you to take a picture of this y siga esa estructura. De hecho, quiero que cada vez que usted responda, responda en todas esas, porque es like the only way that you will remember. In affirmative, yes, yes it is. Y el my wallet le va a cambiar a my pencil case, a my bag, a my calculator, a lo que le ha enseñado su compañero. Or yes, it's my pencil case. En el caso que fuera pencil case. Una vas corta, yes it is. La otra es larga, yes it is my wallet. Y la otra también es larga, solo que contractada. Yes, it's my wallet. Son tres respuestas afirmativas. Luego... Todos van a contestar también en negative, con el mismo, en el mismo objeto. No, it is not. No, it's not. No, it isn't. Ahí son las tres cortas. Luego vienen las dos largas. No, it isn't my, y lo que les estén enseñando. Eh, no, it's not my wallet. You understand? Yes. Yeah. Entonces, por ejemplo, I will have three um, objects. I will have my whiteout. My notebook and my, okay? Okay, um, so I, one, one moment, please. Okay, that's okay, Osvaldo, okay. all right? So I will ask, eh, cuando yo estoy trabajando con la persona que me tocó, entonces yo tengo tres objetos y le voy a preguntar. Por ejemplo, yo tra trabajo con Tania. Tania, is this your toy? Y yo escucho que Tania me diga todas las respuestas. Y nos vamos ayudando, all right? Eh, terminamos con eso, yo le sigo preguntando. Tania, is this your pencil case? 
or your whiteout. Y Tania me dice todas las respuestas, affirmative or negative. Y por último, Tania, is this your cell phone? Y Tania me contesta todas, de todas las formas que están ahí. Luego es el turno de Tania de preguntar y yo de expresar la respuesta. Tania me va a decir, Jessica, is this your bracelet? Yes, it is. No, yes, it's my bracelet. Yes, it is my bracelet. Y así todas. Entonces, tres objetos cada uno y nos vamos eh, dando la oportunidad que uno pregunte y uno conteste. All right? Yes? Okay. So I'm going to send you right now. No sé si le tomaron foto a eso o lo copiaron. Cualquiera de las dos formas funciona, pero sí necesito que ensayemos o que practiquemos estas formas de contestar respuestas de yes, no questions, ¿ok? Porque aquí no se, solo estamos limitándonos, alimentándonos a decir yes or no, ¿ok? So there we go. So I'm going to stop this and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send you to your groups. Ya regresó Osvaldo, very good. So, vamos a, a mandarlos a sus grupos entonces, all right? So there you go, guys. You can click your groups now.
Uh, it's not. It not. It isn't not. Ah, pues son tres negativas, ¿verdad? Y sí. dos más con, con el complemento. Sí. Ah, ok. Cargador, ¿cómo dice el cargador en inglés? Charge. Charge. Oh, ok. Is this your charge? Yes, it is. Yes. It is my charge. Yes. It's my charge. No. It is not. Isn't no. No. It isn't. No. It isn't my shoes. No. It's not my shoes. Many, sorry, how many shoes do you have? One or two? One shoe. One, One shoe. shoe. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Is this your shoe? Ah, okay. All right. Very good. Okay. Yes. Nice. Okay. Okay. Again. Is this your keys? Yes, it is. Yes, it is my key. Yes, it's my key. No, it is not. No, it's not. No, it isn't. No, it isn't my key. Hi, teacher. Hi, Vienna, yeah. Hi, finished? Hi. Finished, finished teacher. Excellent. All right, very good. All right, so give me one example. Tanya, just one, only one, no todos, only one. Okay. Nelson, this is your mouse? Is this, verdad, yes. Tanya? Dele vuelta. Is this your mouse? Uh huh. Is this your mouse? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is my mouse. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's my mouse. No, it's not. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. No, it isn't not. Excellent. No, no, it isn't my mouse. No, it's not my mouse. Very good. Excellent. Bravo. Very nice, guys. Good. All right. We're going to go back right now. Vamos a regresar al grupo. All right. Okay. Do an exercise before we go. Let's go back.
All right, very good. Let's see. Um, eh, Miguel and Osvaldo, give us one example, please, of the uh, questions. Osvaldo, your microphone is off. Mm -hmm. Sorry. <laughs> That's okay. All right. So you ask Miguel. Oh, very good. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Is this your key? Excellent. Yes, it is. Okay. Yes, it is my key. My key. Only one. Yes. It is my key. Mm -hmm. Key. 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 Okay. Yes, it is my key. No, it is not. Mm -hmm. No, it's not. Okay. No, it isn't. Very good. No, it isn't my key. My key. 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 Very good. All right. Very good, guys. Excellent. Bravo. All right. Very good. So the idea yes. is to practice uh, the singular in affirmative and in negative, okay? Do you have questions de forma singular? Preguntas hasta ahorita con, el, con cómo contestar in positive y cómo contestar in negative. Questions or not questions? Tenía una duda sí, con, la, con la pronunciación de it, la contracción de it is. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo, se, ¿Cómo sería la pronunciación? It's. It. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It okay. is. It. Uh, it is. It's. Yes. Ahorita, mm -hmm. Okay. So here, what we have here, Miguel, we have a uh, it's. All right. Solo, solita es it's. All right. Ahora, si se fijan en ninguna de las opciones en afirmativo, decimos si es it's. Eso no, no se puede. Decimos si es it is. ¿Sí? No podemos hacer esto. A ver, se los describo. Esto no es válido. Yes, it's. Esa está mala. Esa no es correcta. ¿La pueden ver? Se lo voy a ampliar. Para contestar, cuando algo sí es suyo, le pertenece o es suyo, usted dice yes, it is. Pero ya no lo podemos contractar, ya no lo podemos tener más corto. Ya no podemos decir yes, it's. ¿Ya? Okay. Solo es yes, it is. All right, es así, por eso tiene la X, porque esa no, no se puede. O decimos, yes, it is my wallet, or yes, it's my wallet. Y ahí sí puedo contractar porque ya es un complemento después del it's, ¿cierto? ¿Ya? Yeah? Ok. Yes, Tania, you understand? Yeah, very good. Nelson, do you understand? Yes. Excellent, ok. Luego en las negativas, ojo con las pronunciaciones. El, ulti, el último no tiene que llevar siempre la T, ¿verdad? No, it is not. En esas suele no haber problema porque todo lo vamos diciendo tal cual. No, it's not. También lleva el not, la T al final, ¿verdad? No, no, no omitimos esa T, esa T. Y el, la otra, no, it isn't. Se oye la T al final. No podemos decir no, it isn't, ¿verdad? No, it isn't. Hay un T at the end, ¿ok? Do you guys understand? Yeah? Yes. Okay, so we're going to move on now with the plural forms, okay? Lo que estábamos viendo anteriormente aquí, que empezamos a ver. A ver, are these your shoes? These, porque tengo dos zapatos, all right? Are these your shoes? Yes, they are. Y regresamos al they, porque ya es plural. Yes, they are. No, they are not, or no, they aren't. Esas son todas las formas cortas. Las largas tendrían, permítame, quiero ver, ajá. Las largas tendrían que hacer eh, ya, como están acá. Yo le digo, are these your color pencils? Y usted me dice, yes, they are. Esa es la corta más corta, in affirmative. Luego usted me dice, yes, they are my colors. Ahí le falta, my color pencils. All right, o decimos no, they are not, no, they aren't, no, they are not, okay, no, they are not my color pencils, or no, they aren't my color pencils. Si se fija igual, la negativa es como las más largas porque hay más opciones, okay. Ve la diferencia de cada una. Dilo ahí y, re, y revise y pregúnteme si tiene alguna duda. ¿Entendemos todas las variaciones que pueden haber? 
Yes, very good, Tanya. Thank you. Uh, yeah, yes, guys. Sir. Yes, all right. Yes. Okay. Yes. Very good. So now we have these examples. Let me see. A ver, hagamos esta juntos. Yo le digo, Tanya, are these your glasses? Ya le estoy enseñando a pair of glasses. We have two. Uh -huh. Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. They are. Very good. Yes, they are my glasses. Mm -hmm. No, they are not. Okay. No, they aren't. Excellent. Is aren't? Aren't, aren't. yes, very good, okay. yes, nice, yes. No, they are not. Excellent. No, they are not my glasses. Uh -huh. No, they aren't my glasses. Yes, very good. Perfect, very good, Tanya, excellent, okay. Here, guys, I just want to wrap this up. Singular, esas son todas las formas singular. Oops. Singular that we have here. Is this his car? Yes, it is. Is this your dog? Yes, it is. Porque estamos hablando de un perro o de un carro en singular. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. Or no, it's. No, it isn't. Is this your motorcycle? Is this my cell phone? Y la respuesta puede ser obviamente negativo o positivo. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. No, it isn't or no, it's not. Okay? Let's see. Uh, here. All right. Oh, okay. We're going we're gonna to continue with this presentation tomorrow. I'm going to stop sharing this right now. Vamos a hacer lo mismo. Vamos a, hoy vamos, voy a, a cambiar las parejas. Okay? Y voy a hacer, voy a ahorita. All right, y ahora vamos a hacer la forma plural. No sé si quieren tomarle foto a, a, a cómo contestamos en forma plural. Para que yes, no please. se les vayan a olvidar ahí, ya voy ahorita. All right, aquí está. There you go, guys. Okay, oops, I'm going to move us from here. So there you go, we have all, those are the options, okay? Y acuérdese, cuando es plural, si tenemos que agregar la S de, de lo que estamos hablando. Colors, glasses, shoes, keys, pencil cases, pencils, ¿verdad? Para que todo concuerde que vaya plural. All right. Finished? Yes? No. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Tania siempre estaba yendo a la oficina, Tania. Yeah, all right. Every day, Tania. What? Every day you go to your office? Every day. Okay. I, I, I like go to my office. <laughs> All right. Okay. Many people are in the office, Tanya, or not many people? No. Okay. Um, no. no. Yesterday? Uh huh. Uh, same 10 people more. Okay. Uh, home office. Oh, my goodness. But uh, some come back all in the offices. Ah, okay. Well, the call center, uh -huh. tengo la duda. Okay. Porque como a ellos se les han movido eh, desktop como tal, uh -huh. mientras los administrativos tenemos laptop, entonces es como más fácil. No uh -huh. es un, una gran organización de movimiento y cosas. Claro. Vea, mientras con desktop es, o sea, es una entrada y salida desde el activo del monitor, activo del Ajá. CPU, y eso es un gran problema en la empresa. O sea, que aprueben un ingreso o una Ajá. salida por el cuenta, que es bien difícil. Más la, más la colaboración de todos los transportes mm. que nos han ayudado a mover, que hasta los técnicos, los que andan de casa en casa, sí, sí. prestaron las chanchitas, los carritos, para, <risa> por la cantidad de máquinas Ajá, sí. que no daban cobertura a los microbuses de tío. Y así pues. Sí. Pero con esa nueva reforma ya paulatinamente creo que se van a retomar mm. las labores presenciales con medidas, pero al sí. menos a mi área no, no nos han dicho nada todavía. Sí. ¿no? 
y el call ah. center lo dudo mucho. Sí. Todavía. Claro, pues sí. Wow. I, I oh, have man. a question. I have y a one question. Yes, what's your question, Elsa? Um, ¿Cómo se pronuncia la tercera en negativa? Tercera en negativa, no, uh, there, no, they are not. Not there. There, ajá, no, they are not. Not, not they are not. Excellent, very good, nice. Yeah. All right, ok. Vamos entonces, los mando a, los, a sus grupos, vamos a hacer otros grupos para poder eh, que participen con otro compañero. All right, ah, nos quedaron igual, no, qué barbaridad. Es que somos muy poquitos. <risa> Vamos a ver. All right. Vamos a ver ahora. Es que esto los hace la compu. Siguen quedando igual, lo siento. I'm sorry. Bueno, no importa. All right, go and work with your classmate. Ok. All right. Escojan dos objetos cada uno por cuestión de tiempo, plural ahora.
All right, let's see. Um, Miguel, can you give us an example of the plural ones with that you did with Osvaldo, please? Question? I yeah, question? You, you ask, yeah, you ask the question to Osvaldo and then Osvaldo answers it. Osvaldo, are these your shoes? <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. Yes, they are. Okay. Yes. They are my shoes. Okay. No, they aren't not. No, they aren't. They no. aren't. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. They aren't. Okay. No, they aren't not. They are not. Okay, very good. No, right. they are not my shoes. Very good. No, they <clears throat> aren't my shoes. Very good. All right, very good. Um, eh, Nelson, can you ask Tanya one example? Nelson, your microphone, your microphone. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me. That's okay. Tanya, Tanya, uh, are these your controls? Controls, very good, uh-huh. Yes, they are. Yes, they are my controls. Very good. No. They are not. No, they aren't. Perfect. No, they aren't. No, no, they are not my controls. No, they aren't my controls. Very good. All right. Bravo, guys. Very nice. Good job. All right. Super, super good. Uh, tomorrow, we're, we're going to stop the class right now. Tomorrow, we're talking about prepositions. Okay. So let's, we're going to review shortly at the beginning of the class about the negative and the positive answers with the yes, no questions with B, but tomorrow we start with prepositions, okay? All right, guys, okay. thank you so much. Good Have a good morning. night. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, guys. Good night, teacher. Good night. See you, Goodbye, friends. Teacher. See you. Bye-bye. Uh, good night.